Good morning, YouTube. Nate here from Thrift Dweller. Tuesday. You know what that means. Glorious day today. I'm very early today. That's why I parked in the back. Got a couple donations here, and hopefully we find something. It's Tuesday, so you think there's a line yet? Oh, one person. I think we will be second in line today. Some vultures in the parking lot. And Queen 8 swoops in from out of nowhere. it all and review it later shall we I honestly don't know what's fully in my hand right now so we'll see what happens Let's find some amiibo shall we doing the morning creep Pretending I'm not looking back there, but just seeing if they have any video game stuff. Ooh, they do have some Pokemon cards. Five bucks. It's too much for, for me to gamble over here. Especially, why do I like Seniors Day on Tuesdays? I've said it before. It just seems to be the day that they seem to restock everything. So, like if you look at yesterday's vlog compared to today's, there's just more stuff on the wall. See if I skipped over anything here. For all you Lego heads out there. Oh, look at that. Little mini arcade. I might just pick that up. It's not too bad actually for a senior's day. Not too busy. I gotta get a cart right away though. Oh, one tidbit I found out about uh, people who shop for clothing. The most popular size is like large, extra large, because everybody wants oversized clothing. Huh, third party GameCube controllers. Let's grab them. <laughs> I ran out of hands there. Oh, I didn't get this yesterday because it was missing pieces. Aw, snap. Five bucks. Doing some second looks, some PC games. Still have the Enter the Matrix there. Red lights, what's that? Bro, second looks for the win. Are you kidding me? Oh, wait. I should pay more attention when I'm walking around here. And there's like a lineup to get inside. I feel bad I'm just wasting my time here, but I'm definitely gonna check that and see if that's complete. I'll look this up real quick. I just messaged uh, Matt from Team GCL if he needs that. Oh, I needed this piece for that uh, force feedback steering wheel I got the other day. Four bucks, that's a good deal. These Mad Cats controllers. I might just grab them because I don't own them yet. And these are the games, just in case I put them back without showing you. Probably going to buy that. Definitely going to buy that. Huh, I don't know. Nitro. What did I see? <laughs> I thought I saw Need for Speed Ninja. I don't have that, so I might get that. Had enough trying to resell these Just Dance games. It ain't happening. Interest. These pops look interesting. Is that Ezio? No, that's the newer one. And whoever that dude is right there, I have no clue. Would you get this, guys? It's brand new. Seven bucks minus 20% off. I might grab it. <laughs> and, oh yeah. You know the clothes? That's from my wife. Does this even work? Oh yeah, it works. Space Invaders for four bucks. It's a long line to get into the store right now and I'm just dilly-dallying inside. Second in line today, pretty good haul for a Tuesday. And we'll do a pickup video. Hot today. It was cool when I got here so I put on a sweater, now I'm steaming. 
All right, welcome back to the lab. Kuya Nate, thank you for joining me. Not too bad of a pickup video today. Some nice, uh, nice little bundle today from the thrift store. Today was Seniors Day. This is everything I did not put back from the video. Here's a closer look at everything I got today. Nice, uh, just for the collection bundle that I got. I'm gonna consider that the maple syrup pickup of the video. So today, I don't know why I bought this Tinkerbell folio case just for the DSi. You know, it comes with like a stylus, I think. Did it come with a stylus? You know, cute little metallic emblem there as the clasp, little lanyard. Yeah, it comes with a stylus. Surprising find on the shelf, $3.99 minus 20% off Space Invaders. It does work. And uh, brand new, these arcades, as crappy as they are, sell for like $25, up to $35 Canadian. <laughs> That's pretty much our arcade one up right there. This bag I got $3.99 minus 20% off. Just had some uh, brand new packaged cards in there. I thought that'd be fun to just open up with you guys together on the channel and reminisce about good old days. Speaking of good old days, this was in a toy bag. Uh, it was a $2.99 toy bag. Brand new uh, Ninja Turtles toy from Burger King. I think this is from like 89. Rad badges. I, have, I don't know. I'll put a picture of the entire lot of uh, toys this set came from. And back in the... I just remember like my cousins having this on their fridge. I picked these up because I wanted to add them to my collection, actually. I don't own them yet. Uh, my wife found this at a uh, ooh, 10 bucks. She found this at a Valley Village for 10 bucks. She's not big on like condition. She'll tell me, hey, I found this. Do you want this? And I'll usually be like, yes. And I didn't realize that uh, it was 10 bucks. Well, maybe she told me and I didn't think about it. I think I thought the condition on this was better. Did not have a manual. And the disc needs some research. I just love wrestling games. Um, Outlaw Golf for six bucks minus 20% off on Seniors Day. This one is complete. Let's check out the condition of this guy. Oh, yeah, really nice. So, six bucks minus 20% off. I was okay with that, even though it didn't have the manual, it did have the disc. And the disc is decent, playable. I don't think that needs a resurface. The most interesting game that I saw Need for Speed Nitro. Six bucks minus 20% off. Really nice condition disc. And there you go. Adding all these to the collection there. Like I said, today's not really about value as much as it is just to add to the collection. And the maple syrup pickup of today's video. Really fun Milton Bradley 60 piece puzzle. Vintage Mario. Like beautiful art. You know, you can try, but you can never really replicate the style of art from back in the day because it, it just doesn't look authentic. Anyways, I did this puzzle with my kids upstairs and it was complete. I'll show you a picture of it there. And online, I think these sell for about like 20 to 30 bucks, depending. I think Super Mario Brothers 3 puzzles, for some reason, I see them on eBay. I don't know if I'm right about this. More Sell more. But anyways, this is everything in today's video. This is what I spent on it and this is what I think it is worth. Again, I don't know what that ratio is going to be, but this was not for the value today. The only thing I'm really going to sell is probably this guy. You know, that's the only resell item today. Maybe Tinkerbell. I don't know. I've been getting into a lot of like handheld collecting right now. So I might keep this for, just for the collection. And these guys, let's open this up on a future video. I don't have time right now. So thank you very much for watching this screen. Eight. Please take care of yourselves and each other.